The underestimated power of alignment. Yeah, alignment is something I mention quite often, and I want to bring in an even deeper perspective of it today. Recently, I heard a statement that said, there aren't as many toxic people in relationships as there are people who are out of alignment. Jeez, my gosh, that's so heavy. Now, I want to go on record firstly, before we get into this, to say that there are toxic people. (laughs) So I don't want this to be misinterpreted as if I'm saying there aren't toxic people that exist because I've unfortunately had my share of experiences with them. However, as my focus has shifted to alignment, I can definitely say that there are more people who I would be aligned with that would cause any situation I'm in to flourish at a deeper level, to happen happen at a quicker, sooner, faster rate, to be a more fulfilling opportunity. And so when you think about alignment, it goes in so many directions, uh, relationships, branding for your business. I'm going to deep dive into that hiring in your business, all the things. I'm going to take a a pause really quick and I'm going to do a quick introduction because hey, it's what's in my heart and maybe that is uh, a space of alignment I need to be in in this moment. Maybe this is your first time listening to me and you're wondering who is this lady? Like what qualifies her to speak on alignment and branding and hiring and relationships and all those things. So I'm Tanya Wilson, Master Life and Business Coach, also known as The Growth Strategist. I function from a three-point perspective. Uh, The basis of my work, what you hear me speak about, what I teach about, what I support my clients in is adapting one, an abundant mindset, personal growth, and business building. I believe when those three things are um, in alignment, (laughs) then you have the best um, scenarios and situations and outcomes and results and whatever it is you're setting your hand or your heart to do. And so when you hear me and you experience me, I am normally coming from one of those three areas. And I absolutely love how everything in my business and brand is coming full circle. So my business is called Renew Full Circle Consulting, and I function from a space where we're looking at business from the inside out. I believe that everything that's going on outside of you is because of what's transpiring on the inside of you. And so many people overlook that. And it's actually the central core space of alignment. So whatever it is that you want to call into your business, into your world world space, into your, your love space, into the space of health in your life, it's going to happen from within. And you're going to align yourself with whatever is happening internally. I was doing a follow-up, follow-up call with a client Uh, recently. And when I call them, it was a random call. I do them periodically with people that I've worked with uh, just to see, you know, how are they doing? How has the work that we've done together impacted their life? Uh, To be there to possibly answer a question that they may have is a random act of kindness, generosity, and a gift that I give to clients who have worked with me. And this particular client did what's called an identity shifting session about maybe two or three months ago. I can't remember exactly, but it hasn't been a year ago. It was, a you know, no more than three months ago. And when we did the identity shifting session, there were so many things transpiring in their life that they did not desire. There were so many things like on the edge for them. And, you know, immediately upon starting the identity shifting sessions, which is about alignment, it's about 
becoming the person you need to be in order for the thing that you desire to come into your life. It's about shifting your identity and your self-concept and how you're seeing things, but mainly about how you are being, which is an internal thing. All of that is alignment. So are you in alignment with what you're wanting to call in? That's always the biggest clue. Are your words, thoughts, and actions or deeds, are they in alignment with what you want to call in? So I'm on a random you know, call with my client and she, I said, hey, is it a good time? And she said, I'm actually catching a flight. And I said, oh, okay, um, should I call you at another time? She said, I have a few minutes. We haven't taken off yet. And I'm in first class, my darling. <laughs> and so we just kind of chuckled, you know, because, you know, just a few months ago, this was not the scenario at all. And so our identity shift in sessions are a three-week time frame. We do this identity shift over a three-week time frame. And it's so beautiful because there's such a huge space of awareness that can literally bring you to tears. Sometimes we're just not aware of how we're being or where we've gotten this mindset from that's actually keeping us from the things that we desire. And so we work on that in that three-week time frame. We do, you know, an, an activation of what your true desires are. And I remember when we first started the identity shifting sessions, um, all the things that we were talking about and, you know, me just really aligning fully with what this person needed in order to make the shift. And as we're finishing our sessions, I'm asking, um, how, how has your experience been? How have things changed? And they revealed to me that within 24 hours of a starting, right, they began to get like larger sums of money that they weren't expecting, $3,000. People were buying things from their product list, their list of services, that they simply had not been buying. She was getting notifications of things that just, they weren't selling prior to. And many may hear and say, oh, it's coincidental, but we have a frequency and a vibration that puts us in alignment with the things that we desire. And so even when I'm working with the client on branding, because that is about alignment, right? It's about shifting to a more abundant space that calls in what it is that they desire so that they are a match so that how the world space sees them because your brand is how the marketplace sees you, right? That's the brand, that's the idea that your frequency, your flow has put into the marketplace. And so you attract people that bring in the results that are in alignment with who you're being. And so one of the things I do when working with clients is we work on your brand DNA, right? The internal aspects of who you are as a brand. Your brand is not your website. It's not your logos. It's not your pretty pictures. Those things are formed after determining who you are as a brand. Then you find collateral things, which is your website, logos, pretty pictures, business cards, things of that nature. Collateral things that align with who you are as a brand. Who you are as a brand is like a state of being right? It's like an archetype of all the energy and frequency and um, all of the space of existence that you take up in the world and what you attract back into it. And so your brand, it, it's about alignment, even hiring. I, I believe I've talked about hiring recently. I'm, I'm working with a client who has a team. And so I always uh, just go back to the space of hiring for me I owned a brick and mortar service based business for over a decade. And in that first year I hired and I was just not happy with the people that I was hiring, but I had a revelation, a download that said, you hired these people. And it was like this aha moment for me because so often we are holding the space of victim of so many things in our life. Not that people don't victimize people. This is a whole different um, context of how I'm speaking of victim, but so many times we hold the space of victim as if we can't change what's transpiring, like in our business, as if we cannot earn more revenue or get greater clients. Uh, 
um, or call in greater opportunities. We hold the space of victim so much that we do not think what we desire is possible, but so much of that is coming from your alignment. Like what thoughts are you having? How do you see yourself? Who are you really being? And my part with my clients is to, you know, give them just new levels of awareness and the strategy that align with that. And so when we're talking about even hiring, that is also about alignment. And so today, our subject is alignment. And my question for you today is, are you in alignment with what you desire? Are you in alignment with what you want to call into your life? I personally have taken on a space of doing a new identity shift. Now, I've done this many years um, of my career and of my life. I've transitioned to something else. And many of those earlier times, I did it unaware. You know, sometimes we can do identity shifts because we have no choice. Life presents this thing that you have to come out of and you find your way out. Unfortunately, it's often through a space of survival. You find your way out from a space of survival and survival thinking and survival energy. And so, of course, you create survival alignment. So all the things that you call in are also only to allow you to survive and not necessarily to allow you to thrive. But when you intentionally go through the identity shift and concepts that I support my clients in, you're not doing it from a space of surviving. You're doing it from a space of thriving. I'm stepping into this new thing. I'm calling in this new thing from a space of thriving. That means it's coming in abundance. It's more of what you desire. There's less settling in it. You're aligning yourself with what you truly, truly desire. My question for you today, are you in alignment with what you truly, truly desire? I'm Tanya Wilson, Master Life and Business Coach, also known as the Growth Strategist. I would love the opportunity to, to support you. If you know that you're looking for another, another level of support in your life or business, maybe this identity shift in thing was what really caught your eye. I'll put all of that information how to work with me in the comments. I have private opportunities. I have an academy, 3D Success Academy. By the way, if you're hearing this in the next week or so, uh, 3D Success Academy will be $1,111 off for my yearly 1111 sale. So you can take advantage of that. You can join us inside the academy for $1,111 less the regular price. That's my take on today. You can always reach me at renewfullcircle.com. Peace and abundance.